Okay guys, so just jumping on the underground again at uh, Tottenham Court Road Station um, heading towards Brick Lane can't remember the name of the area actually yeah, Liverpool Street that's where it is um, so we'll be there soon guys so if you're coming from Oxford Street um, or Oxford Circus area and you're going towards uh, Liverpool Street you gotta take the central line um, which is eastbound all right so yeah let's get going oh it seems to be somebody uh playing some sort of music underground it's a nice little touch so yeah i noticed that my card is almost full so at some point I'm going to have to change it over station Liverpool Street and I'm on my way it's about a 13 minute walk um, to Brick Lane area um, after Brick Lane after I do a bit of a, a walk around on a Sunday which is just after midday um, I'm gonna see if I can squeeze in the uh, apple crumble as I, as I was saying earlier so uh, Let's see how it goes. Let's see. Okay, it's another uh, cold day. I've got like about four layers on. A vest, a t-shirt, um, a fleece, hoodie, and this green jacket that you're seeing now. Um, and obviously walking also helps stay warm as well but I mean it's not doing a massive difference I would say but at the same time it's not absolutely freezing but it is cold last night was really really freezing I had my hands out of my pockets for just minutes and I could feel the pain man that's how cold it was but yeah around here looks cool built up area I'm sure down that way is I'm sure I've been down that way before but I'm not 100% sure I would have to check the sat nav to to totally be sure let me do that actually yeah actually I think it is that way so I'm going to cross the road cross this road guys quickly don't get hit by these bikers they're just as crazy as the uh, car drivers, to be honest. Since these have been out, I've never used any of these bikes. Never. And I don't think I actually ever will, unless I need to. Maybe in the summer, I don't know, maybe. Okay, this is what it looks like on a Sunday if you were wondering obviously Brick Lane um, will have a lot more energy going on hopefully <laughs> hopefully oh yeah and um, about last night so I did go to um, Pop Brixton I went back there uh, 
and I probably mentioned it in the previous video but um, it was a bit of a flop there was a no-show of DJ people and energy um, mainly because I think there was uh, there's issues with the management of of the venue and so all the independent stores that have their businesses there are like looking kind of over their shoulder expecting some uh, harsh news because it's obviously going to impact on their business but um yeah i mean i'll keep you posted if i find any any information about it but yeah as long as it's open guys i do recommend that you go to pop richer brixton pop brixton london and uh, have a look okay because it is quite cool I don't know what that place is. Let me go have a look. Oh, I know where I am. This is the other side of uh, Spitterfields Market or Old Spitterfields Market. Now, I haven't been on this side, funny enough. But there I am. As you can see up there, Old Spitterfield Market. Here you see loads of little stores in independent sellers um, and artists and all sorts of different things selling artwork, clothing, jewelry, uh, the lot. It's cool. But we'll come back. I'm gonna go to Brick Lane first, okay? So, guys, I'm gonna jump forward and then come back, okay? I'm gonna jump forward and come back. probably checked out my other video um, where I went where I came to Brick Lane and I went inside uh, the market on the right hand side just down there if you can see it Brickyard Market um, today I'm not going there at least not yet anyway um, more than likely it's gonna be the same vendors actually no I was told that sometimes it's different vendors um, because there's a lot of uh, independent brands but anyway, I'm going to get some food guys because I haven't eaten anything all morning so guys, my uh, card was full I had to change my SD card and so I'm back on the move towards um, Bagel Bakes to get my first bagel I'm going to try the, um, the well-known I think it's salty beef or salted beef, something like that. Um, I mean, it's meant to be a popular choice in London. So I am looking forward to trialing it out and uh, giving you my verdict on it. Oh, I'm really cold, guys. Sorry, I'm really cold. <laughs> it's really getting colder. But anyway, um, yeah, let me flip the camera around so you can see the energy going on around here. Lots of uh, street vendors. Kind of reminds me of uh, Candom Town, but not as vibrant. At least today is not as vibrant. I don't know.